It's time for Eric Plays the Beginning, episode 11. Hey guys, how's it going? Boy, it's a bit dark in here. There we go. Alright, so game should be starting any minute now, and we'll see what's going on in that champagne room now that all the kids are asleep. I'd, I mean, this game is at most rated teen, I'm sure, so. But this still might not be something I necessarily want to explain to four year olds, right? I always get excited Let's here. See. Behold, physical proof of my importance! Well, right this way, sir. <coughs> I always believed in you, Dead Spank. Did he? Alright, let's see. Whoa. This is... scary. Guess they don't talk. Alright. Might as well grab this while I can. Excellent. Lots of money. Ancient poker. Healing potion. There's a love beds over here. Love by gripper. Interesting. Greetings, breadwinner. <laughs> I am here to rescue you from this den of mechanical pleasures. But I can't just leave all these mechanical maidens behind. Why, those like Tiffany bots over there are working their way through college. That's but what hilarious. about your family? My what? Your son, Elroy, your daughter, Chastity, and your wife, uh, Oven Girl. <laughs> oh, them. I suppose I do have manly duties to attend to. But it's hard sometimes, Death Spank. The wife always needs something. Elroy's no good at sports. And Chastity. Sorry, I was thinking of something socialist. Pack your bags, father figure. It's time to move I on. Be a fight or something. Well, I think the girls might have something have to say about that. Oh, Tiffany's. Uh -oh. <coughs> Kill the pleasure bots. Oh shit. Oh shit, 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 shit. This does not work in here. I'm gonna die. Oh boy. Oh boy, that was not good for me either. Pleasure bots are slain. Aw, nuts and fudge. <laughs> All right, move it out. All right, cool. Bring Dick home. <laughs> just realized the double entendre there. This robot's just stuck here. Greetings again, Lucy Eisenbein. Goodbye, mistress. hate because it's hard to see where Greetings, I'm going. vendor of potions. I'm looking to buy some liquid enhancement. Mm. Mm. 
<laughs> get teleportation to defenestration. That's awesome. Which means being thrown out of the window. Sure. things here. And the engorge potion. I'll put here. Alright. Let's go find out. Oh boy. Yikes. Oh boy. You guys, I just popped the potion. the science. McClure. Well, if it isn't poop enthusiast, Strunken McClure. Oh, is that guy's husband? Howdy there, Death Spank. The days of poop and roses are far behind me now. <coughs> I got so sick and tired of Ima, I finally left her for good. Really? You two seem so... Well, not happy, obviously. Let's say happy for now and come up with a better word later. <laughs> mm. I'm serious. I will never, ever go back to her. Ever, never, ever, never. You see, here, I can do whatever I want. Nobody bugs me to put down the toilet seat, or put the lid on the toothpaste tube, or throw away my wrestling magazines. <laughs> Plus, these clones are amazing. Standing next to these ugly mugs, I actually look pretty good. Uh. So why are you done with Ima? Well, you met her, so you should have figured that out by now. Good point. Why are you here? Clones will do anything. Anything! Let's say, hypothetically, you have some dangerous farm equipment that needs testing. A clone will drive it into a volcano with nary a whimper. <laughs> that could come in pretty handy. <coughs> what do you love about this place so much? I can do whatever I want, and that suits me just fine. Now that I'm single, <laughs> I can even chew tobacco again. Though it's gonna make me spit something fierce. Mm. Hell, I could probably fill a spittoon in no time. Sure do wish I had some right about now, cause I got me a <coughs> hankering. Hmm. <laughs> Fear not, Strunken. I will score you some addictive chewables. All right. Well, that sure might have nice of you, Death Spike. <laughs> Goodbye, Farmer Strunken. Important things I need to do. But it has to be processed. I bet that means get it from that place. That's what I thought. Yeah. 
You must be the nuclear man-child. Indubitably, for I am <coughs> Elroy Nuclear. Boy genius. Somebody's full of himself. It's you. Since my family established this scientific preserve, I have endeavored to create the perfect childhood companion. This cloning facility appeared suitable for the task, and yet, all the subjects I create are flawed in some way. Compulsive explainers? What? No! They're two-legged. But what I really want is something with four legs and two heads. But no time for that, youngling. Your family needs you. I can't leave! I just can't! Whoa. I'm so tired of being without a friend of my own. Have you tried being less of a weirdo? <laughs> Find me a two-headed, four-legged companion, and I'll go home. Right, you dog. said this is a cloning machine, so why not just make what you want? This only replicates humans. You just need to put some of the person's DNA in there, and out comes a clone. But sadly, I've run out of cloning components. Or, as I call them, clone ponents. Without these base materials, further cloning is impossible. What a <coughs> conundrum! But perhaps, recycling of failed experiments is the option. You may be a blooming mad scientist, but I like your environmentally conscious thinking. I will recycle that which is needed from the cloned abominations. One chunk from each kind of clone will suffice. Um. So I know that... I think there was a dog near Ina. So what happened between you and Strunken? Him and me landed this peach of a job from the nucleus. We do light repairs, change light bulbs, uh, uh, bury the occasional body. Mm. When suddenly he said we weren't compatible, he ran off with that creepy Elroy nuclear kid. I knew that boy was no good when he tried to measure my duodenum. Mm. Good boys don't do that, you see. Can I take your dog for a walk? Certainly not. What? That dog is protecting me from the perils of this park. Doesn't seem too perilous around here. Boy, it gets much more perilous later in the day. Are you sure I can't take your dog? Well, you can't take him from me. He's all I have to hold at night. Huh. And I'll keep holding him until okay. Strunken returns to me. I gotta take care of Strunken first. Goodbye, Ima. <laughs> All right, let's see. Let's go to that one so that we can. It's Becky. You must go through so many shoes. Yarp. 
Hold still while I use Mr. Sword here. Don't worry, it's just like going to a dentist. Huh? Or possibly an undertaker. Yarp. Huh. I got one clone pony. And wasted my justice. Alright. Some vendor tobacco. That one's out of order, unfortunately. Alright. Actually, I guess I should walk so I can go to different clones. Hey there, Mr. Funny Face. Yarp. Hold <laughs> still, Mr. Cloney Pants. Death Bank needs your kidneys. Okay. No, I don't need to fight you. Uh -huh. I got one of those already. I got one of those already. Okay. All right. Uh, let's give this guy his thing. Greetings again, Strunken. I have some vendor tobacco for you. Oh, why, thank you, Despair. Here it comes to spit. Hmm. Hope there's a spittoon handy. Hmm. Goodbye, Farmer Strunken. Alright, so. Greetings, Eric. Yarp. Got us the good news. Yarp. Alright, three of those now. Alright, so, so far I wasn't able to get the dog, but I wonder... Can I... So what? Well, you matter! Good! Oh, did that already. Alright. Goodbye, right. farmer! So I haven't figured out yet how to make him... ...go to her. Just drunk him. Ah, okay, I cloned. Got it. Hello there! Yep. Uh. Now wait just a tick while I cut things off you! <laughs> Probably will. Yep. Hmm. Alright. Yeah. Alright. Do, 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 do. wonder if I just have to go to someone I haven't gone to yet. Hello! Yep. Okay. That tells me I did that one already. Hello, gentle. Yarp. No, but I think. E Boom. So, let's see. Salutations, <laughs> clone. Yarp. Time for Death Bank to cut some clone. I know you won't mind. Yarp. Yarp. Okay, that's six. Alright, let's see here. Hey there, Fudgy. Senior. So I notice you're a little heavy in clone components. <sighs> Let me cut them off. Senior. All right, one more. Maybe it's this guy here. Hey there, Mr. Yarp. No, nope, done that one already. You must go through so many. Yarp. Done that one already. That's a hard look to pull off, <coughs> but you, you're looking good. Yarp. Now just hold still, little freak. <laughs> uh. Yarp. All right. That was not so hard. Alright. Let's talk 
to the boy, get the clone, clone this dude, get the dog. Behold, boy, for I bring you clone opponents. Excellent. I will load them into the device. There. It's almost too easy. Does that make you want to go home yet? Not until you bring me a boy's ultimate companion. <coughs> Just checking. Uh. Greetings. Oh, man. Goodbye. How do I get him cloned? I have to put someone's DNA in there to replicate it. Uh, okay, maybe now I can do it. Greetings! Goodbye, farmer. Hmm. Hmm. All right, I'm pretty sure it has to be shrunken. Maybe I need to look at the... The hints. Liquid. Okay. Spitting. Oh, okay. Let's take the... Teleportation. I knew that while I was here, but maybe I wouldn't have been able to because the way these point and click adventure type things work. <laughs> Alright, let's see. There it is. At least I figured out on my own I had to do uh Strunken, I just realize how to get his DNA. <laughs> All right. Back to Elroy. There we go. I guess all that talk about spitting was supposed to let me know. I just didn't know it was there. I don't think he wants that. Greetings, and behold the spittoon of destiny. And I must say that's a beaut. Hold still <coughs> while I fill it. I am not looking forward to this. <laughs> nice. Follow me, handsome. <laughs> oh, that's probably why I had to do the bridge, because he can't go in the outhouse with me. Missed. Stupid Christmas tree. Oh, he has this weird. He has like feet on his hands. That's funny. Greetings again. I'm a apple hole. I have for you your husband. Or close enough, anyway. Oh, Death Spank. Thank you. Now that I have Strunken back, I have no need for this dog. You take him, Death Spank. Uh, nice. Now it's here. time for me and Strunky to be alone. You. I'll just retreat to a safe distance then. <laughs> Might as well teleport. Greetings, child. Perhaps an animal like this is what you're looking for. I'll just do an extremity check. Four legs, two heads. This is perfect. Thank you, Death Spank. <coughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Sure thing, kiddo. Mm. I'll probably have to find a therapist for you next. <laughs> All right. Now for Chastity. She's all the way over there. Lots of fighting to do to get to her. Yeah! 
damage, get some! Cookie man of tomorrow. Whirlwind of justice. Oh, now these guys show up. Oh my god. That hurts. Three things at once. Oh boy. Hurry, run, 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 run. Run, 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 Oh, they got me. Oh, I do have a bomb I can throw. I do need to recover my cash. Gummy warm up tomorrow. Hmm. God darn you. Why? So this thing is over. Alright. Oh my god. What the hell are these guys? I know. I don't feel so good. Alright. That worked out. Got a lot of treasure chest keys. No treasure chest though. Ah. Regular drill of justice. It's the overcharged drill of justice. Yeah, not quite yet. Can get rid of this one though. As well as this goofy hat. <laughs> Muto fan club shoulders. This is for level 9. What level am I? Huh. Maybe I'm level 8. No, I'm level 9. Alright. I knew someone was going to shoot me. Boom. Oh boy. Enormous now. All right, you do. I think I'm getting really close to uh, chastity. Well, I correctly predicted. Oh my god! Oh boy! Oh, we're too slowly for this. All the way over there. <coughs> yeah, you again. Ooh, level up. 
All right, I'm gonna do. Oh. The road we saw of cutting. Chainsaw greater chains. Let's see, what does this guy do over here? The overcharged drill of justice, 450. All right, I'm gonna exchange it for that one then. And get rid of this glove. And the shoulders of the technocrat. Of tomorrow. The shoulders of tomorrow. Alright, let's get going. Now, I think almost everything I have can use justice. It's pretty cool. Chase me, candy man. Alright, now we fight. Seven trillion dollar gloves. Nice. Don't come fight me yet. Okay, here we go. What's up? Still eating, still eating, still eating. Alright. Shrink. Oh my god, this guy's huge. Ah, I can be huge too. Got him. Classic blade. <coughs> I'm almost at chest speed. Club soda with lime. Oh boy, you again. sure what being giant size does other than look cool. It must hit harder or something, right? It's got to. I died. Oh, I'm like right there, I think. See it back there in the background. Long walk again. Oh boy. Alright, this is probably getting close to quitting time now. Gotta Put my oldest to bed. <laughs> what is this here? Armor potion. Oh, okay. Gotta use that next time. What's up, big boy? For me, food vendor. Greetings, food bearing capitalist. Mm. I'd like to exchange money for taste. Mm. 150, 500, 600. Alright, cool. 
Alright, let's see. Major healing potion. Put that there. Um, I'm gonna put the club soda. The love valley. Of course, Jesse would be here. Scary. Oh boy. What the hell happened there? Are those guys explosive? What the hell was that all about? Inventory full, huh? Alright, well. We don't need this chest piece anymore. Alright. Eastern Wisdom Shoulders. Interesting. Artificial Jilted Lover. Oh, that's funny. Someone's shooting at me. Oh, a crossbow guy. Cool chucker. Get these shoes. Inventory full again. Seven trillion dollar shoulders. Go fan club gloves. What shoes am I wearing now? What are these? Yeah. No, not this time. Go brush your teeth, little one. Oh, you have your comics for tomorrow. Whoa. Scary. Lime. Oh my god. You stuck to my healing. Yikes. Hey up. Artificial pure love. Ooh. Artificial boyfriend. And I'm set. Because I'm going to this girl who's in love with someone, or something like that. Ah, I need that potion. I think I do. Alright, let's see. Don't need these stupid boots anymore. And, uh, maybe I need those boots, I don't know. Don't need the fist of the unicorn. Alright, here we go. Oh boy. So many baggers. Oh boy. <laughs> That's the helmet I'm wearing right now. Yeah, it's pretty gross. 
Alright. Do I have any other healing potions or anything? No. Alright. I'm gonna have to eat that. Money. Nuclear daughter. You got to kill her? Oh, can't talk to her, uh -oh. talk to her right now. What is this? Right, nope, don't need this stupid helmet anymore. Alright. Greetings, newbile youngster! What do you want? It's time to return home. It is food consumption time with the family. Uh. You can't make me leave. At long last, I've created true love. Nobody ever wants to do it the easy way. <laughs> Raphael, this old uh -oh. man is trying to take me from you. Uh-oh. Kill Raphael. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. That guy shooting stuff at me is Raphael. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh. Nope. Especially since he keeps staying way over there and shooting at me. Huh. It's time to go home. That was no monster. He was my one true love, crafted for pleasure by my firm hands. The way he, he. That's pretty messed up. Mm. You should go home and see if your parents want to uh, physically educate you. Uh. Where is she? All right, all my quests are done. Assemble a nuclear family. I did that. And I have to destroy Thong too. In the, the kitchen is part by bacon fire, so I gotta go all the way back to the beginning. Really? Well, not the beginning of the whole game, but the beginning of this level. Oh. Mm -hmm. What happened to that girl? Oh, everyone in their family blows up when they get upset. So they sure so she died? No, she's alive. She teleported to her family. That's a weird. What does nuclear mean? Nuclear? Um, it means like nuclear power. It's when they use um, atoms to make electricity or bombs. Alright. I'm just gonna teleport there instead of walking all the way there. That's how it was just like before. So you can see the family? Yep. Is that the girl who... Yeah. Why did she look so different? I don't know. You can see your mom. I want to talk to her. Behold, citizens, your lost waifs. Now, now, don't coddle the boy. Last thing we want to do is raise a socialist. I'm not a socialist! Stop calling me that! It makes me so mad I could... Oh, how I hate him! Be quiet, all of you! My authority at dinner is absolute! Whoa, chillax, <laughs> citizens! Getting a little intense here! <laughs> All right, cool. I can go get the second big fire. 
Probably. Because I have four more underwears. Is. It's not in that direction, apparently. Alright, go. Brush your teeth. Take care of 
That's definitely. See what's Oh, my bad, guys. Oh boy, oh my god, I'm about to die. Oh, there we go. Alright. Huh? Oh, it's a casino. More leprechauns. The house always wins. That's true of real life casinos. Yep. Casino always wins. They have the odds stacked in their favor. Once I get to the next outhouse up there, I'm gonna brush your teeth and it'll be bedtime for you. 2%? Ha! Death Bank likes those odds! Uh -huh. I'll talk to them later. I'm at the casino outhouse. Alright, let's save. All right, this has been Eric Klein of The Baconing, uniting the nuclear family, and now off to the casino. Bye. So that's what you're going to name it?